Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back. If you're new to the channel, I'm Dean with Old English Outfitters, and we are back once again with Bill Martin of Defense and Trading Solutions. Today we are going to be doing our first installment in our new series, Range Drills. So we wanted to do this because we have a lot of people coming into the shop and they have problems that they haven't diagnosed with their shots. They say, hey, my gun's shooting low and left, and they don't know that hey, you know, it's you, not the gun. The gun will shoot straight. You need to fix your shot process. And Bill, being the wealth of knowledge that he is, um, we wanted to utilize that in a format that anyone could watch and observe. So what we want to do with these drills is cover basic problems, how you can fix them, how you can shoot a drill and diagnose what may be wrong with your shot process, and then use that to improve. And just basic training drills, something you can use to say, hey, now I can present faster from concealment. This is how I can practice that. Fast sight acquisition, again, for concealment, for self-defense, for duty use. So with this series, we're going to give you the information and the tools it takes to improve your shooting and your shot process. Hey, everybody. Uh, today, we're just going to work on diagnosing some common pistol shooting errors. So, Dean, are you ready? You ready. All right. First thing we're going to do is make sure we have our ear protection on. So uh, check, make sure you've got your ear protection on. If they're electronics, make sure they're turned on so you can hear me. Get your eye protection on. Uh, now carefully just draw your gun out from your holster. Let's uh, check the condition, make sure it's loaded and ready. Good. Okay. Uh, first drill, right there to the center of the target. Five rounds, nice, slow, and steady. Right, so we'll go ahead and carefully reholster here. Good. Make sure I don't shoot myself on a mic wire. Yeah, that would not be a good thing, would it? All right, so what we're seeing up here is uh, first few shots, you're really pulling low and left. Mm -hmm. um, so we want to, what that typically tells me when it's low left is you're doing something with your trigger finger, mm -hmm. um, kind of kind of yanking it or pulling it really hard and down low and to the left. Okay. Could be trigger placement, your finger placement. Uh, also going to be something going on with your grip. So the way we're going to fix that is go ahead and draw your gun out and point out. Okay, go ahead and aim in. What you do is I want you to take your left hand off of your gun, put it on your chest. I want you to take these two fingers and let them off the gun. So the only thing gripping your gun is this finger and your thumbs up. Now, finger on the trigger, aim at the center. Give me a nice, steady squeeze. Nice, steady. Much better. And one more. Good. And go ahead and get both hands on the gun. Now, we're going to do the exact same thing. Go ahead and aim out there. I want you to take these two fingers off again. I want you to take everything but your index finger off the gun on this hand. Yep. And aim at the center and squeeze. One more. Squeeze. Now, both hands on the gun. Good grip. Make it feel the exact same way. Tight with this hand and squeeze. Good. One more. Squeeze. And you are empty. So if you want to re-up. Oh, I got one more. You've got a, a uh, more. malfunction here. Give it a rack. Go ahead and carefully reholster. Good. Good. And what we see here is it was a combination of errors there. It wasn't necessarily your trigger press because we brought them all up and into the circle. Your hands are working together mm -hmm. and pulling that grip low left here. All right, guys. So you see, that's exactly what we wanted. We ran this drill. We did our five rounds of slow fire, and I was definitely coming low and left here to start. I had a one here, one there, a couple here, and then one a little bit closer. I could kind of tell what was going on trying to correct that. Then Bill showed me, okay, this is what that means. If you're doing this, you might be sinking your trigger finger in. You're squeezing it too hard. You're jerking low and left that's what's going to happen for a right-handed shooter vice versa for a left-handed it would be low and right so we were able to correct that and there is my last group of shots that is improvement and that's what we want and that's what we want out of this series guys thank you so much for watching if you like what you saw please like this video leave a comment and subscribe to our channel i'm dean with old english outfitters and we will see you next week